Okay, today is March 18th, and that means that Flash 10.2 has come to the Motorola Zoom and Android 3.0. So right here, I'm on the Android market, and I'm going to scroll down here, and you see Flash Player 10.2 right here. I'm going to click on that, and we're going to download it. And I'm going to click Install. And it doesn't require any special permissions to run. I'm going to hit OK. And I'm going to install it. Now once this is installed, I'm going to pull up a couple of Flash pages and show you what Flash is like on the Motorola Zoom tablet. OK, I have a notification in the lower right-hand corner. And that tells me that Flash Player 10.2 has successfully been installed. So let's back out of this and let's bring up the browser. Now there's two things I'm going to show you here. I'm going to bring you to YouTube and then I'm going to bring you to Congregate, both of which use Flash. Now Congregate is, if you looked at some of my previous videos on my channel here, Congregate is a game channel which uses Flash games. And of course YouTube plays in the browser with Flash. So let's go to YouTube first. And I'm already signed into my channel here. What we're going to do is we're going to go to one of my recent videos. Now I'm just going to pull the sound down on this a little bit because I want to talk and I don't want my voice, I don't want to have to talk over my own voice. So we're going to click on the latest one here. And instead of looking at it in the YouTube app, we're going to look at it on the browser. Now instead of having the error message here, you see that it's loading up right now. Now this is all in Flash. I should probably actually bring up the sound on it just so you can see how the performance is. Now the one thing that you're going to get on Android devices that you will not get on iOS devices are widgets. Now let's mute it again. And I'm going to try and bring it full screen. Now you can see the performance on it is pretty good. The movement on it is pretty smooth and it's very watchable. Let me make it full screen and as you can see it's very fluid. Very good performance. Now this is running in 480p. My videos are in 720 and right now it's not letting me upgrade it to the 720p. Supposedly within a couple of weeks the 720p will be very fluid. That's what they're working on. Uh, that's, that's the last I heard on it. But as you can see flash runs beautifully on the device. No hiccups and it's very smooth actually. Now we're going to try Congregate, the site that has flash games on it. So let's back out of this and let's see Let's go to Congregate, spelled with a K. And we're just going to pick a random game on here. I don't really play a lot of these games, but it's a great way to show how Flash works on a device. Let's try Ninja Hamsters versus Robots. Alright, I think it's loaded up. We're just going to click to start. And here we go. Game loaded. Click to start. And I have no idea how to play this game, but we're going to wing it here. Okay, here we go. Click on the background to chain and attack. Collect sushi. Okay, so I think you just have to swipe on it. We'll see how this goes.
Okay. Got some sushi there. So basically I just have to click on the enemies and the little hamster attacks the robot. I suppose I can't jump off of this platform. Looks like there's some lasers in the way there. Okay, I can jump down to the lower platform. But as you can see, this is all in Flash. And this is how Flash performs on the Motorola Zoom tablet here. And it's pretty flawless. And it's nice to have a device that you can use the entire internet on. And there aren't really any restrictions here. So I think that's pretty much it, just to give you a demonstration. That's Flash on the Motorola Zoom tablet. And it's nice to have, like I said. So that pretty much does it for this video. If you have any questions or comments, please post them down below. And I will see you next time.